Hi, I'm Jamie Klossick and as promised we have Kevin Nash here live to answer all your questions from the different topics of the day from our Anglers Mail page and the Facebook page, Nash Tackle. Kevin's favourite question on bait was this from Chris Atkinson. Kev, what in your opinion makes a good bait? What factor keeps the fish coming back for more? My answer might seem a bit simplistic. A good bait is a bait carp like to eat. Um, yeah. I'm saying that because they love eating tiger net nuts, for example. You know, but a bait that are keeping them coming back for more, you know, my translation of that, one that I'd use in over a season of, of trickling in regular baiting, you know, on the basis that I keep trickling it in there, keep wanting to eat it and eat it and eat it. It's got to be a bait that's nutritionally balanced, it's got mm -hmm. everything they like. They uh, benefit from it, indeed they grow from it, as you know, Jamie. Mm -hmm. Nash bait's gone a lot of waters, and you know, after it started being introduced, the carp have rocketed in weight. In weight. That's a sign of you know, a bait that does them good. And yeah. those kind of baits are the ones that work long term. What? Start adding stuff like squid extract, you know, that attractor that they can't resist, it's like a drug, and you've got, you've got the, the greatest carp bait you can ever have, I think. Is that your favourite Nash bait, the, the Scopex squid, or is there a better variant of it you like? I caught um, a few years ago, I said I'd caught like, at the times on 20 English 40s, and I said I'd caught 17 of them on the Scopex squid, yeah. But, <laughs> it's going to be your favourite then. <laughs> well, funny enough, I haven't used it in the last two or three years, but the key, I keep having to be the guinea pig and do the field testing, because the field test is soap and field test, they just want to get on the bait and hammer it, you know. So I'm the one who ends up doing the testing. I've used from the IC1 to the monster squid, uh, I'm testing one at the moment, I can't tell you about it, see with it. Basically, if it's got the squid in it, you know, anything goes for me. I'm, I'm the same with Gary, it's maybe a new bait, slightly different, but put the squid in it. But occasionally you do get one that's got an edge over the others. Would you still go back to the Scopex squid if you start a new lake? Um, what's your, what you're taking with you, what you're armed with? Funny enough, I did move on the new lake yesterday and I'm going in with this new test bait. Uh, but yeah, right. yeah, it, yeah, if it was a lake, which I was going to do a campaign on for a big fish. My rule in life is always go back to what you know and you're most confident in. So yeah, yeah I'd definitely go back to Scopex Squid, as you say. Scopex Squid, it is. Rules. <laughs> so that's the answer. Uh, any bait will do, providing it's Scopex Squid.